know how the nighttime traffic is around here. Of course. Mind if we come in? I was actually about to step out. But we're only going to be a minute. I just want to take a look around. No, not tonight. Well, we're already here, so we'll just take a look. So what have you been up to tonight, Mr. Edgar? I mean, I mean, Alan. Uh, I mean, I mean, Edgar Allen. And our dear friend Wheeler at Cable, Mr. Bernstein. Well, it's going to have to be shorter than his since he's on an expense account. We're not. Let me see. Mike. Go ahead, Mr. Kane. I can't prove that. I don't want to lose all my youth in jail. Please, understand? I think you're hiding something. If we get arrested, we'll both look guilty. You're not getting it. I'm not your wife. I'm not even sure if I'm your girlfriend. Just don't say anything. I'm telling you. How do you weigh in on this? I think that people are just afraid. People are afraid of someone like, I mean, because she's different. Yeah. You look in society's mind as this beautiful straight woman and- But I'm not. Very gay. But, very, but very you're gay. gay. I'd like to say that I think Shane is dressing like a woman. Shane is dressing in the way that makes her feel um, best. Right. And Brad, come here. Come up here, brother. Okay. So, here's the deal. Okay. You've been very brave today. Yes. In talking about your apprehension with asking certain questions of certain people, typically black guys, right? Yes. Okay. Yes. So, or, or people of color, as you said, or African-American if they're from Africa, but sometimes you're not sure and you don't want yeah. to say that. Okay, so I have an adventure for you. Here's how the ambush adventure okay. works. You have to say yes to the adventure before you know what it is. If you say yes, you must complete the adventure. If you don't, you disappoint not only me, but yourself. Yes, you're in, sure. you're in, okay. So. I want and I and Mr. Livingston, you put an ad in the school paper. Yes, I did, Your Honor. Advertising your particular apartment. Yes, I needed to sublet my apartment because I had an overseas assignment. All right, so you needed to sublet for just a short period of time. Yes, or? six months, Your Honor. You were going to be gone for six months. Why were you going to be out of town for six months, sir? For a school project, we go overseas to study. Abroad. Are you a student as well? Yes, I am. Same right. school. And why did you select Miss Carr as a person that you felt comfortable doing that? Well, I had a lot of people respond to the ad. I mean, it's a great deal, and it's very close to campus. It's mm -hmm. a really good apartment. But when she came, she seemed like a really nice woman. I got a question. I have a friend that has an ear infection. If I borrow his earbuds, can I get an ear infection? Can you stop an infection before it spreads? Well, that was Brad, who has a question. And Dr. Ward, I'm going to ask you, What's the verdict? Is what? Brad at risk for an ear infection from his buddies? I mean, that's a great. Know that your underwear can affect your health. Well, Brad has this question about that. Is it best to work out with or without underwear? Come on, man. What do you How do you work out without underwear? Well, I mean, yeah, <laughs> things are going to be jiggling around. <laughs> so she starts to turn to the dark side. First, as an excuse, then to get some attention. You know, buying the books, playing with the cards and the board, trying to cast spells, speak with the dead, even make a few deals. But what she didn't realize 